Welcome back to Fiddlehead Fiddle Lessons. I've been away on tour. I posted a whole bunch of lessons before I left, but now I'm back filming again. It was a good tour with Diego's Umbrella. Had a lot of fun shows opening for our friends March 4th. We got to play this place in Albuquerque called the 4th North uh, Art Center for developmentally disabled adults. I got This is a Souvenir by Rosie. Thought I'd share it with you. And anyway, so it's good to be back. And I'm going to start with a, a lesson on an easy version of a tune called You Ain't Going Nowhere, country song written by Bob Dylan, covered by the birds. I'm going to do um, a very simple version of the vocal melody. And then in a later lesson, I'm going to do the uh, pedal steel part, which is more involved. And all this, this, this song and the next batch of songs I want to do are about learning how to play fiddle on songs, learning how to jam, how to approach that. So this lesson is going to be more about just how to simply play the vocal melody. It'll be a good for if you're an absolute beginner, this is actually a pretty good lesson for you. If you're not, it might be too easy. But anyway, stay tuned for the series on how to play on songs, all right? So uh, anyway, I hope this is useful, and I hope the whole series turns out to be useful because a lot of people have said, well, especially my own students, in-person students, like, oh, I, I want to know how to jam. I want to know how to play with other people. So that's going to be the goal. I don't really know what I'm doing, but that's going to be the goal of this series. So I'm just going to play you the tune, very simple version, um, You Ain't Going Nowhere, and then break it down for you step by step. There it is. So there's a lot of like things where we're holding on third finger. And um, it's actually, even if you're a beginner, it's relatively easy in terms of the notes you play. It's sort of the rhythms and the repetition of single notes that I think is what might make it hard. Um, but there's a solution to that, and that's singing and playing, all right? Or singing what you play, all right? So whether or not you like singing, I think it's a great tool and it'll help you learn any music, but especially things that are actually songs. So the first line is, ooh -wee, ride me high. So you go ahead and try to sing it. Maybe you're, you gotta sing it softly or hum it or whistle it because somebody's in the other room and you're embarrassed, but forget about that if you can. Ooh -wee, ride me high. All right, and now I'm going to play the first quarter of what I just sang on the fiddle, all right? So here it goes. Okay, that's the first quarter. Starts A1. And then... Ride me high. Again, if you actually sing and play it, it'll be easier. I'm going to remind, encourage you to do that right now. So I'm going to sing the line once and then play it. And, and do that in a loop. Ooh-wee, ride me high. Ooh-wee, ride me high. Time. Ooh, we ride me high. All right. So this lesson is about the tune. You ain't going nowhere. But more generally, and it's about singing and playing. How powerful singing is. All right. Let's move on to the second quarter. Tomorrow's the day my bride's gonna come. And now I'm going to play it for you on fiddle, slowly. Alright, so it's a lot on D3, but if you sing it and break, help break it up that way, it becomes easier. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. So just sing tomorrow, then play it once D3. 
And then the next line is, the day my bride's gonna come, the day my bride's gonna come, my, the day my bride's gonna come. Now just play it. So we have the whole line will be, tomorrow's the day my bride's gonna come. Here it is again. Tomorrow's the day my bride's gonna come. All right, let's move on to the third quarter, which is almost identical to the first. Oh, we gonna fly. So it's, I think there's just an extra note on the A, but I'm gonna play it on fiddle, breaking it down anyway. Okay, so that starts A1, and then it's gonna go open A twice, D3. All right, so um, let's do the thing where we alternate singing and playing again. Oh, oh, we gonna fly. Oh, oh, we gonna fly. Then the last um, quarter is sung down in the easy chair. And I'm going to play that on fiddle now. So it's all third finger, but it's a tricky rhythm. Down in the easy chair. But singing makes all the rhythms easier. If you have to figure them out, they're harder. But if you can sing them, you sort of just got it. All right, and that's the whole tune, the basic version, and that's all gonna give you in this lesson. I'm now gonna just play the whole thing um, a couple, maybe once or twice through, very slowly. I might kind of sing it at the same time, and that could be a goal for you down the line to sing and simultaneously play it. But if you're a beginner at this, I recommend holding off because that's pretty hard. All right, so here we go. Um, so here, I'm counting you in. One, two, three, four. Ooh, we ride me high. Tomorrow's the day my bride's gonna come. Oh, oh, we gonna fly down in the easy chair again. Lastly, I'll just say, if you want to do, it's a relatively simple tune in terms of fingering. If you want to do something extra with it, extra credit, to get your grade up. Just kidding, I'm not grading you. Um, you can transpose it, or which is another, another way of saying that is you start it on a different string. So instead of starting A1, we could do the exact same thing and start a D1. So on, or we could start at E1. All right, so that'll give you something a little extra to get out of this. And any lesson or anything you practice transposing is a great way to get better with something you already know. All right, well, I'm glad you made it to the end of another Fiddlehead Fiddle lesson. See you next time. So long.